Denver tonight, the Denver Police Union says it has no confidence in their police chief, Robert White, and they want him fired. Rick Sounder live tonight from Denver Police Headquarters for us. And Rick, what inspired the union to hold this no confidence vote? Well, Karen, this is the first time that the Denver Police Protective Association has taken such action. They tie it to two incidents, primarily an accident that occurred last month. It was more than just a traffic accident. The car of Denver's chief of police was sideswiped by another vehicle. The chief then followed before the suspect car crashed into another vehicle at the Aurora Denver border. While the investigation is ongoing, some rank and file police officers have questioned whether the chief may have violated departmental policy. The relationship is at an all time low. And both that relationship and public confidence in the police department have been eroded by recent incidents. The chief later apologized in an email to his department saying he had joked at the scene about a rivalry between Denver and Aurora police. The police union is also upset over the handling of an open record request. In response to the survey voted by an overwhelming majority of 94 percent that they had no confidence in the ability of Chief Robert White. Chief White came to Denver from Louisville, Kentucky six years ago. In response to the union survey, he issued a statement saying during his time in Denver, we have focused on improving our policies and culture, and these changes have been met with resistance by some. However, it's my responsibility to make the right and sometimes controversial decisions for the betterment of our department and city. CBS4 has made open records requests for the tapes from that accident that we referred to but so far have been denied because the investigation is continuing. As for the chief, well, the mayor and the manager of safety both issued strong words of support for him today. Live at Denver Police Headquarters, Rick Salinger covering Colorado First. Rick, thank you.